Brain fuck, a minimal esoteric programming language designed to make your brain hurt. It's Turing complete, but not designed to build actual software. It's more like a work of art that challenges the status quo. It was created in 1993 by Swiss physics student Urban Mueller, where the goal was to create a language with the smallest possible compiler. It was built for the Amiga 2.0 operating system, and the compiler weighs in at under 200 bytes. A brain fuck program starts with a 30,000 byte one-dimensional array. All values are initialized to zero, then it provides a movable point pointer that you can manipulate with eight different commands. Use angle brackets to move the pointer left or right by one cell at a time. Then increment or decrement the value in a cell using plus or minus. Use a period to output the byte at the pointer's current location, or use a comma to accept input and store it at the pointer's current location. And finally, use opening and closing brackets to create a loop. Notice how BrainFuck doesn't require silly things like variables, functions, and classes. To get started with BrainFuck, delete your operating system and install Amiga OS. Then create a file ending in .bf, which stands for brainfuck. Any characters that are not the eight I mentioned previously will be ignored as a comment. At this point, we have an array with 30,000 8-bit numbers, all set to zero. To say hi mom, we'll need to set each number to its corresponding ASCII character. We can increment the first cell, then enter a loop with an opening bracket. For each iteration of the loop, we'll decrement the current cell by five, then use an angle bracket to move one cell to the right. We'll increment that cell by three, then move back to the left and close the loop. The loop will continue until the original cell goes back to zero, at which point it will exit. We now have a value of 103 at index 1. We can move the pointer to it, increment it to 104, then use a period to output it. That corresponds to the letter H in ASCII. We can increment it again to get 105, which corresponds to the letter I. Now we continue this process of manipulating memory like cavemen until we output all the characters that we need. Now to run your code, use right-click, copy, and paste it into one of the many online interpreters. Congratulations, you just said hi to your mom and brain Fuck. This has been BrainFuck in 100 seconds. If you want to see more BrainFuck content on this channel, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.